Good morning. Welcome to Breakfast with Sally Nugent and Dan Walker. Our headlines for you today. A green deal. Hundreds of thousands of homeowners could receive vouchers of up to £5,000 for home improvements to help kickstart the economy. A small number of pubs have shut their doors after customers test positive for coronavirus. While others continue to crunch the numbers, I'll hear from owners concerned that sales are too low to be sustainable. As the easing of lockdown continues, hot air ballooning returns to the skies above England. We'll watch them fly. Frustrations boil over at Tottenham as two of their players are kept apart in a Premier League win over Everton manager Jose Mourinho said it's just what his team needs to grow up. Good morning. We've got rain already in Northern Ireland. That's going to be pushing eastwards through central parts of the UK through the course of today. On either side of that, something drier and brighter. But I'll have all the details at 27 minutes past. Good morning. It is Tuesday, July the 7th. Our top story. Hundreds of thousands of households in England are to receive grants of up to £5,000 for energy-saving home improvements such as insulation. This is part of a wider £3 billion green investment by the government which aims to create thousands of jobs across the UK in the wake of the coronavirus pandemic. Our environment analyst, Roger Harabin, has more. Insulating homes gives a triple benefit. It saves on people's bills, it cuts carbon emissions from heating and, crucially, as the UK heads towards recession, it creates thousands of jobs for tradespeople crawling in attics and measuring draft proofing England can't reach its climate targets without a major refit of housing stock, but until now the Treasury has been reluctant to help because it means transferring cash from the public purse to private bricks and mortar. Now the jobs factor has swayed its opinion. From September, homeowners will be able to apply for vouchers of up to £5,000 for work certified by an approved builder. The Treasury says more than half of the £2 billion allocated will go to the poorest households, which will pay nothing. The UK has the most energy inefficient.